The driving distance from Boston to New Orleans is 1,519 miles. You can drive it in 25 hours, says Google Maps. What is your average speed? Speed, what's your average speed? How do you calculate speed? You know how speed is always so many miles per hour or so many kilometers per hour. You know, I'm driving at the speed of 55 miles per hour. That's my speed. Speed is always miles per hour. And that tells you how to calculate speed. You take your miles and divide it by your hours. Okay? The per means division. Miles per hours is your average speed or speed. And so all we need to do is take the miles here, divide them by hours. And let's see what my calculator tells me about that. 15, 19, divided by 25. Okay, it gives me a decimal number. It is 60.76. But I'm gonna round it, okay? I'm gonna round it to whole miles per hour so that I will get 61 miles per hour, okay? In 2010, the vehicles in the United States completed this many miles of travel. It's an estimate, okay? This is a humongous number here. And we would have here millions, billions, this is actually in trillions to trillion nine hundred eighty five billion ninety five million miles of travel okay that's how many miles all the vehicles about traveled now the US population in 2010 was about three hundred eight million eight hundred thousand calculate the average miles per capita which means per person miles per person in a year so how many miles did each person travel in the US in one year, on average, okay? And again, it has this per here, miles per person. So we take the miles and divide them by the number of persons. That's all we need to do. And a calculator will help. This, let's just see if we can fit this really long number into the calculator. I have two, nine, eight, Five, zero, nine, five, and then six zeros. Two, three, four, five, six. It doesn't even quite fit. It has to push some of the digits off this end of the display. Then divide, and then three zero eight eight zero 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 zero, and then equals. Okay, I get a long decimal number here, but I'm gonna round it. To the nearest whole number as far as answering the question. It shows me here 9,666 point something and after the point is a 7 so I'll round up. I'll round it to 9,667. Miles per person. Okay, every person in the US on average traveled that many miles in a year. Now calculate also the average miles per person per day. If everybody traveled this many miles per year, then in one day they would have traveled, on average now, this many miles divided by the number of days. Because it is the per day, it means division by the number of days. So I'll just take my previous answer here on the calculator and divide it by 365. This divided by 365 equals 26.48 and so on, which I will round again to the nearest whole mile and get 26. All right, I hope you had fun. Calculator can be a fantastic tool when used right, but do not use it for every little problem there is that you can also calculate mentally, okay? We're all done with this list.